It's Adam with the Productivity Academy, and I just got my hands on um, my Remarkable tablet. It's been great. I've got a previous video about my initial impressions, so uh, go sh check that out. Link will be below if you're interested in that. But what I wanted to talk about is if you have a Remarkable tablet or you're thinking about getting one, for me, one of the things I realized was, wow, you know, I need more ways to get things out of the Remarkable tablet. It's great to get it out of my head, to get it on there, maybe to annotate something or to just draw out my ideas, write down some ideas. But then from there, I need to make sure it gets to where it needs to go. So your options are you can export it manually in the sense of using their app. Okay, that's great. Gets it to your phone or the computer, or you can send an email. So since that option exists, I thought, ah, okay, what I would like to do since I use ClickUp as a project management tool, I would like to be, set this up as a zap so I can send an email and it automatically goes into ClickUp. So I don't have to deal with you know manually moving things one time, then open up ClickUp and do this and that. I want to be working on the tablet and then send it and not worry about all of that and know that it's going to end up somewhere. So if you don't use ClickUp, this is uh, something you could do. You could replace ClickUp with Slack. You could replace it with whatever other tool is connected to Zapier, right? There's thousands. So maybe, you know, something else that you're using for a project management tool, for a CRM, whatever that may be. There's so much you can do, but this one for now, at least for ClickUp is a three-step zap, which means this would be need to be a paid account in Zapier. But I believe there's other ways to do this. You could probably figure out how to do this in, in two two-step zaps, but I just want to speak to this because this idea really opens things up. And you know, depending on what tool you're using, you may not need this. But what you can do is basically set up new inbound email as the trigger, which is really cool. And then all you do is give it a name in the sense of they provide, and I'm not going to show it because I don't want to get a bunch of emails uh, with attachments sent to my ClickUp account, but you get a Zapier email address with some random stuff in front of it. And then you get to add the very beginning of that. So for example, you might put sending from Remarkable to ClickUp just so it's really obvious. And then on your tablet, that's where you send it. And then it'll do what you tell it next. So the action I have is to create a task. Okay, it creates it, gives it a name based on whatever you want it to be, or it could be the subject line of the email you send, and then it adds the attachment in ClickUp. And then just the way they're set up in here in Zapier, that's the way it had to be. But hopefully this gives you some ideas of what you could do to send yourself emails of either the single pages in the PDFs or of the entire things, you know, to pipe this around wherever you need it. So for me, this really boosts up the usefulness of this tool and already it's something I've used so I can share it with my team, whether I need to delegate something, whether I want to be reminded of it later, but getting into that system saves me a bunch of manual steps and really extends the usefulness of this. So if you've got ideas for other automations or questions about how this actually works, by all means, leave me a comment and happy to get back to you or create videos based on uh, kind of extending the usefulness of Remarkable using ideas like this.